Why did a white South Carolina deputy shoot a black homeowner? That's the question investigators are trying to answer. Action 3 News reporter Deb Tuff is live in the news center. Deb, what do we know so far? You know what? Uh, police haven't released names yet, but the details are still murky. So what happened in Charleston Wednesday? Here's what we know. The sheriff's office says two black men were seen fleeing from this house on bikes towards his backyard. The deputies went to the back of the house. They saw a man with a gun and we found out he was the homeowner. They told him to drop the gun. He didn't. Then one deputy fired and shot the man in his neck. He was taken to the hospital and now has life threatening injuries. So investigators are trying to figure out what happened. The deputy and the homeowner's name will be released today, and this is the same city just for history's sake of where video surfaced last month of a police officer shooting a man in the back as he ran. That man died. That officer was then charged with murder. For Action 3 this morning, I'm Deborah Tuff.